How to choose signal bar. Number five, non-trend bar. Signal bar normally is the start of the trend. For the non-trend bar, there are three things. The first is the body is less than 60% of the whole candlestick. And the second, the probability of the trend start is low with the non-trend bar. The third is that a lot of times after the non-trend bar, you can see some small wave pullbacks later on. Here is an example. So in this chart, we can see we have a level and then it's breaking this level. We wait for the pullback and then the signal bar. Here comes the first bar here, this bear bar. You can see the body accounts 58% of the whole candlestick. And um, it is leaning at the top of the candlestick, the body. If you enter here, you can see it's triggered by the next bear bar. But later on, the wave will be coming up to test the uh, previous pullback here. And then this is not a very good start of the trend. Then after the market goes down a little bit, we see another pullback with this bull bar and then the next bear bar. The body accounts 32% of the whole candlestick. And if you put your order at the bottom, you can see it's not even triggered. And then there are two consecutive bull bars after it. So this bear bar is not a very good signal bar. And then later on, we can see there's another one. This bear bar has a body of 85% of the whole candlestick. So this is a trend bar, not a non-trend bar. You can see the market goes down by two other consecutive bear bars. So you can see this as a start of the trend. After the market pullbacks again, you can see the next bear bar here. The body is 56% of whole candlestick, but the body is leaning to the bottom of the uh, whole candlestick. So this leads to um, trends. It's a start of the trend. And then the next bear bar here, you can see the body is 46% of whole candlestick and uh, the tail at the bottom is big. So combining with the next bar, which is a hammer, Together, this two bar can be good signal bar. So you can see that next bar, this doji bar, you can enter the market by putting your order at the bottom of this hammer. So by these examples, you can see that basically the trend bar will have a higher probability leading to the start of a trend. Non-trend bar has a lower probability.